Hi, I'm Jenny. And I'm Caitlin. This is your WCCO at the State Fair newscast. Today's headlines from the great Minnesota get-together start at the Miracle of Birth Center, where a brand new baby calf came into the world. It was said to be a moving affair, and in a developing story, State Fair officials are following up on reports of a giant stuffed gorilla seen walking around the midway today. Witnesses say it's a black and lime green stands at eight feet tall. Authorities don't believe he's dangerous, but they are warning fairgoers to use extreme caution if they spot him. Fairgoers have been belting out Demi Lovato and Nick Jonas tunes at the giant sing-along. The dogs in the pet center across the street have been howling right along. They are surprisingly good at keeping the beat. Speaking of dogs, a southern Minnesota artist finished her giant parcho puppy sculpture outside the Fine Arts Building. She says it's made from from all over one million pachata puppy pork chop and an alligator on a stick. Now let's send it to sports. Hi there, this is Sneha with your sports news. The State Fair Ring Toss Radio Rodeo has a new grand champion, a 12-year-old girl from southern Minnesota threw a perfect five for five besting our own Chris Schaffler by one ring. WCCO's investigative team is looking into the possibility that the girl is actually a, a ringer brought in from Iowa. That's all for sports. Let's toss it into weather and traffic. Thank you. It is a hot one out there at the Minnesota State Fair. We have reports of ice cream cones melting in less than two minutes. It turns out the uh, average fairgoer eats their cone in 10 minutes. We do have a warning in effect for fairgoers. Brain freeze numbers have tripled this year. I'm Emily in the Weather Center. Back to you. That's your news for today. I'm Jenny. I'm Sneha. And I'm Caitlin. Thanks for watching WCCO4 at the State Fair.